Hello, welcome back to Linux Wednesdays, where we look at Linux tips and tricks on a Wednesday. In this week's video, I'm going to show you a few fun commands you can do in your Linux terminal. I'll link these commands in below, so you can just copy and paste them into your Linux terminal if you wish to try them. If I right click on the desktop and go open in terminal, now it hit full screen with a plus, and I can type in app moo and press enter. You see there we've got a picture of a cow in ASCII characters. I can do a cow think and then subscribe and press enter. There we go. The word subscribe comes out in a thought bubble from the cow. I can do a cow say and then subscribe and the cow's got a speech bubble over it saying subscribe. I can now do a fortune And then cow say. Press enter. You see there, it's giving me a question or whatever, or some quotes from some famous person. Press up, press enter, press up, enter, up, enter, up, enter, up, enter. You see there, every time I go up and enter, the cow's giving me a different fortune. If I type in yes, Followed by some words, so subscribe. You see down the screen there, like an old age computer, we have the word subscribe. And I press Control C to quit it. I can change the word subscribe to anything I want. See there, we've got the word line it's down the screen. If I type in aptitude and then moo, it says there are no Easter eggs in this program. If I push up. And stick a minus V by it and press enter. It says there are really no Easter eggs in this program. Stick another V in there. Didn't already tell you there's no Easter eggs in this program. One more in there telling me to stop it. One more in there. If it gives me an Easter egg, will it go away? And we should stick one more in there. And there we go. What was it supposed to be? Is that a picture of a house or something? I don't know. But that's a little bit of fun you can have in the Linux terminal. I can also do a cow, say, minus F. Ghost Busters, who you gonna call? And there we go. Look at that Ghostbusters sign in ASCII characters. Now, if I run Telnet and type in Tel dot Blinken Lights dot NL. We get a ASCII cartoon of Star Wars. Now this will work with most terminals. I've had it running on a, uh, an Amiga terminal, had it running on a BBC Micro terminal, an Amstrad NC100 notepad terminal. Also had it running on an old uh, Scion 5 terminal. Let's see if we can get our Star Wars cartoon. There we go, 20th Century Text presents as our Star Wars cartoon. There was a few fun commands you can try in the Linux terminal. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, the other button seems to work too. And I'll see you in the next one. Now to sit back and watch this uh, Star Wars cartoon. And as always, thanks for watching.